Why'd you kill the music? I think you know why. Um, <laughs> I don't think I do. It begins with an L? Like the L word? Lesbians? Lost, Max. We're lost. We're just, we're in geographic flux. Right, so, lost. That's debatable. Oh, heads up. Yeah, honey, nice catch. Thank you. Man, the roads are definitely getting worse out here. I guess it's all part of the rustic summer camp experience. Oh, right, that's where we're going. I lost track like 200 miles ago. 200 miles ago, huh? Yeah. You know what, Max, it's okay. It doesn't make you any less of a man. You know, if Columbus hadn't gotten lost and landed on these golden shores, there would be no United States of America. Goodbye hot dogs, see you later apple pie. Columbus never actually landed in North America. What are you talking about? Didn't even know he wasn't in Asia. Are you serious? Just another guy who didn't want to admit he was lost. Well, just another guy who's got a whole day named after him, so... Put that in your pipe and smoke it. Oh my god, okay, just get us to camp already before I roll my eyes out of my head, please. <laughs> I'm working on it, I'm working on it. What is that? Yeah, yeah. No, but seriously, how what happened to the, the normal map? This is the normal map. The one on the phone. No bars. Of course not. Okay, let's see. So we are... Well, I guess they don't put summer camps on maps. Have you seen any signs for it? Hey, eyes on the road! Jesus Christ, what do you think that was? A bear? What? No, no, Max, it wasn't a bear. What was it? I think it was a person. Lord, are you serious? Do you think we hit a person? I don't know. I mean, it was really cl close, like really close, but maybe we didn't. What is it? I really have this car up. Well, maybe it looks worse than it is. Uh, I should check out the damage before we try to start it up again, huh? Could you grab my, uh, the, the toolbox from the trunk? Yeah, yeah, okay. so bad. My mom's gonna kill me. Yeah, actually, if you could just shine a light right here. There you go. Perfect, thank you. 
The sooner we get out of here, the better. Just picture yourself curling up in front of a big old fire pit singing campfire sing-alongs. I don't think people curl up right in front of big old fire pits. Why not? Uh, they don't want to catch on fire. And then picture yourself curling up in front of a big old space season. Well, anywhere is better than here. Where are you going? Just over here. Just stay there for a second, okay? I'm almost done. God, Max, hurry up! What's going on? I'm worried that there's somebody down there. Are you serious? Yeah, that is. they could be hurt. I don't know. I didn't think we actually hit anyone. Well, I don't know. I just, I heard something, okay? Like a, a woman. Do you think we hit her? I just want to check it out. Okay. All right. Just don't go too far, okay? Be careful. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Luck with the car.
Honey, honey, take a breath. It's okay. It's the woods. There's a lot of stuff out there. There's animals. It's easy to freak yourself out. No. Can we just leave, please? Yeah, 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 yeah. Let's go. Okay. You all right? Yes, there we go. Purring like a kid. Max, come on! Here we go, here we go. We're getting out of here. Are you fucking kidding me? Max! I just, okay, give me a minute, give me a minute. We've got to go, Max! Why you're not helping right now. Can you just, I am trying to get us out of here. All right, just... enough! Shit, I'm sorry, honey. I'm sorry. It's okay, it's okay. We're okay. We're safe in the car, really. We're gonna be okay. Jesus! Oh, fuck! fuck. Oh my God, my heart just exploded. Roll it down. Hi, officer. How are you doing this evening? Are either of you injured? Really, we're fine. We're just a little shaken up. Mm -hmm. Well, you folks want to tell me what happened here? Yeah. We, um, uh, something jumped out right in front of the car and we didn't want to hit it, so we swerved and, you know, here we are. Something jumped out? Uh, I'm sorry, it was, just, it was so dark and it happened so fast and they were gone. Uh, they? Ma'am, did you hit someone? No, no, God, no, of course not. You know, I mean, I don't think so. I don't, I don't know. Sir? Keep the car running. Sir? Is this guy like the all-time scariest cop? I don't know, this is my first cop. What, like ever? Uh, yeah, I'm not a criminal. You folks want to tell me just what in the hell you are doing all the way out here this late at night? We're heading up to Hackett's Quarry Summer Camp. We're new counselors. You're one night early. No, no, we know. Um, but we figured we'd get in early and scope it out, you know? I mean, they know we're coming. We called ahead. And to be honest, sir, one of us kind of oversold their navigation skills and got us completely lost. You're not going to make it to Hackett's Quarry. Not tonight. Harbinger Motel. It's the nearest place you can bunk up there for the night, okay? Uh... I think we're just gonna stick to the plan, sir. I mean, Mr. Hackett knows we're coming and we called ahead. No, ma'am, you're gonna head to the Harbinger Motel. Do you understand? Okay, fine, yeah, we'll head to the motel, understood. Uh, there's just one small problem. 
I forgot to spring for the middle of nowhere coverage plan on my phone. What he means is we're lost completely. All right, ma'am. Step out of the vehicle. Wait, what? Um, I just want to show you how to get to the motel on your map there. Okay? Uh, for sure. Son, remain in the vehicle. Okay. Okay. So, we... are right about here. Harbinger Motel is here. Right, okay, and where was Hackett's quarry again? Well, I'm sure the fine folks at the Harbinger Motel can guide you there first thing in the morning. Harbinger Motel. Stay on the road. Wait, but, but what if there's someone out there? Yeah, I'll have a look. Good night. Why is this guy just sitting there? That guy was giving me major weirdo vibes. The dude needed like at least a dozen showers. Oh my god, I know. What was up with the thing? I Did you see was, that? Was it blood? Nice to meet you. Get back on the road. Yes. I think I've had enough woodland encounters for one night. Thank you very much. Agreed. So where's this motel? Okay, so we're here. Mm -hmm. And the motel is here. Okay. But we're going here. What's there? Hackett's Quarry. How'd you do that? I don't know. I kind of tricked him into showing me. <laughs> very slick. Are you sure we shouldn't just get to the motel just listen to this guy's advice? Honey, you really want to listen to the advice of some creep-ass cop who told us in the middle of the creep-ass woods to go to some creep-ass hotel? No, that sounds terrible. Yeah. Let's hit the road, shall we? That's what I thought. Ma'am. Oh my god! If he called me ma'am one more time, I was gonna shove that badge up his dick. Like, <laughs> Seriously, do I look like a ma'am to you? I got like 20 years before I'm a ma'am. Mm-hmm. What? I... 20s debatable. Easy. I mean, I'm kind of into maps. Okay, we're done here. <laughs> you gotta be kidding me. There's nobody here. We drive all the way the fuck out Max, here. Max, can we just look around before we jump to conclusions? Did you actually even talk to Mr. Hackett, or did you just leave a message? Well, what's the difference? This. This is the difference. Hello? I guess he doesn't check his voicemail. How was I supposed to know that? I mean, clearly there's somebody here. Yeah, or it's just an abandoned car, and this is a complete waste Why of time. Why would there be an abandoned... I'll get the car. Max, come on. Max, don't be a dick. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Is anybody home?
What doesn't kill you will make you stronger. I'm gonna get some help. Max! Max, get over here! What's going on? There's somebody in the bunker. I think they might be stuck. Stuck? Is it Mr. Hackett? I, I don't know. Just bring some tools so we can break the lock. Hey, I'm back. We're gonna get you out of there. Hey. hey. Wait, what, what are these? I don't know. You just said tools. Why didn't you just bring the... Look, there's someone in there. Um, I'm not seeing anyone. What? No, look. I'm looking, I am. Let me see. There, there was definitely someone there. Okay, okay, so... You sure? Yeah, saw it online. Damn. You need a hand? Yeah. You've seen the evil dad, right? Hello? Are you hurt? Do you exist? Hey, be careful. Max? Hun, maybe it was a possum or something. No, there was there was someone here, I swear. Hey. It's been kind of a night, you know? Let's just get to the motel. We can come back here first thing in the morning. We can check everything out, but... I mean, you must be exhausted. I know I am. I think our imagination... <laughs> Oh. 
I think I'm bleeding a lot. My friend, welcome to the show. We are friends, aren't we? I've waited for you. I've waited, yes. So I do hope our time together proves enlightening. There's no need to worry. I'm here to help you. Think of me as your guide into the unknown. It's exciting, yes and terrifying, but if you're brave enough, if you let me help you, I can help you. We can help each other. You didn't find anything, and so I've nothing to show you. You need to look harder. The cards are out there. If you don't help me, how can I help you? We're supposed to be friends. You said so yourself. Search harder. Only you can find them. There are secrets out there, you know. Secrets and lies. Paths to uncover on which I can shed light, if you let me. Help me help you. And remember, what doesn't kill you will make you stronger. You know how many hearts are broken on the last day of summer camp? It's like a romance apocalypse. Hmm. I mean, you never know. The universe has a kind of way of uh, 
working these things out. The universe? Yeah, like the uh, the cosmic space gods. Space gods. You heard me? Okay, spell it. It's nothing to spell. You know, we're cool. Oh, so cool. We are super cool. So she dumped her ass, huh? Hi, Emma. Hey. <laughs> okay, this is, um, you've heard of spatial awareness before, yeah. right? Spatial awareness is for nerds. Uh, be a lamb and grab the last couple of bags, will you? Yes, boss. Say hi to Emma for me. You're a bad person. Yes, I am. Oh, hey, this is Emma's. Jake, bags, focus. I wonder what's killing the deer. Doesn't kill you will make you stronger. Not in the mood sign. <clears throat> hey, what do you, uh, what do you listen to? Good to know. Are you guys gonna help with the bags or what? Oh, um, you know, I was actually just working on fixing uh, the door. It's Dylan, come it's on. broken. Dylan, please. I can't. It's. it's I gotta get the last bags what's in there. Come wrong on. With this thing, it's just Dylan, closing. please. Sorry, guys. Cool. Thanks, guys. Shit's bolted it? Really?
nap. Who'd want to leave a place like this? It's like a goddamn Bob Ross. Skill. <sighs> oh, double skill. Man, that's a bad place to get stuck. <clears throat> All right. Got the bags. Great. All by yourself, huh? Yep. Guess you're gonna have to get used to that. Oh my god, you are so mean. <laughs> At least I'm honest. Oh, okay, here we go. Okay, you're not telling me the whole truth about you and Emma, are you, son? Oh, okay, so now I'm the one who's not telling the whole story, huh? <laughs> oh, well, this is the bait I just gotta take, Jake. Oh. Oh, sorry, I just got so distracted about that rhyme, I forgot what we oh, were... Oh, no, 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 uh, y you were telling me how you totally have a thing for Ryan. Wait, are we talking about Ryan, the sailing instructor with the sexy brooding loner thing that totally doesn't do anything for me at all? Ah, oh, sexy, huh? How does that camp by far? Okay, sure. Uh, look, it was all settled by the girls in Bunk 7, like, second day of camp. It goes Ryan, me of course, then Dylan, Emma, Abby, Okay. Nick, and then Mr. H, and... Okay, are you almost finished? Please? Yep, that's it. That's everyone. So she really just dumped her ass, huh? I don't... Okay. Her whole thing is like, how are we gonna make this work? Different schools, blah blah blah. My whole thing is like, you know... Maybe long distance, blah, 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 blah. And she was just like, Jacob. She gave you the look, huh? Yeah, do not pass go. Man, she just got you wrapped all the way around that dainty little finger of hers. How does she do it? <laughs> oh, but I mean, seriously, come on, she's right. It's just like a stupid summer fling. What else did I think was gonna happen? Uh, let's see. Uh, love, stability, engagement, marriage, house, kid, affair, kid, divorce, loneliness, child support, visitation lawsuit, mm. surprise reconciliation, emptiness, retirement, grandkid, 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 uh, nursing home, and finally, dying in each other's arms and then being buried in each other's arms like those thousand-year-old skeletons they dug up in Rome or something. That kind in the ballpark? Oh, shit, I'm sorry. That was Ryan and me. Uh, let me see. Ah, 
Here it is. Yours just says Roadhead. Oh, actually, that's just a generic all men list. Oh, well, that seems legit. <laughs> Okay, so are we sure that this old rust bucket's roadworthy? <laughs> we'll take a look. It better be. One more night in the great outdoors might actually kill me. Hey, what doesn't kill you will make you stronger. Well, I haven't killed you yet. And you're still pretty pathetic. Hey, shut up. <clears throat> uh, okay, so, um... Total hypothetical, but if I was, like, a huge asshole and I wanted to break down the van so we'd have to spend another night here, uh, what exactly would I need to do? Well, you'd probably break the fuel line or, I don't know, rip out the rotor arm. And yes, that would make you a total asshole. Okay, and what does a rotor arm look like again? It's like an arm that's all rotary. You know, it's under the little black dome with the leads poking out. Jake... You do realize that even if we somehow did get stuck out here, one more night with Emma wouldn't make a difference. Trust me, Chick's made up her mind. Yeah. Sure. Guess we'll just have to find out. right back tomorrow. No harm, no foul. Up here, my dudes. Why do they look like they're up to something? Hey, Jacob. What? No, dude, please. D don't, don't. Long. Oh, Nick! <laughs> Boom. Oh. oh. There it is. Oh, Ooh. man, good sight. Ooh. Freak. Oh. Uh, Ooh, I wish I had some singles. Oh, freaks. I'm surrounded by freaks. Oh, thank God. I'm gonna get the whole no technology thing, but take me back, world. You would have thought Mr. H could have, like, charged up our phones, like, a little bit. Nothing's ever your fault, is it? You know, you should really just save it for emergencies only. <laughs> Unless, of course, is being dumped an emergency? Ha <laughs> oh, Ben. Uh, okay, well, at least I had a relationship this summer. Ooh, damn, now we burn. Yeah, well, maybe not everyone is looking for a hookup. Okay, 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 let's all put our little dicks away and get this show on the road, huh? Where's everybody else? Why, why would I know that? Mm -hmm. sometimes you know stuff I don't. Look, I don't, I don't even know how to respond to that. You say, Nick, you're way smarter than me, and you're a super hot stud who gets any cheeky ones. Okay, yeah, keep German Junior. Hey there, party bear. Status report? We are officially empty nesters. High five up top. Oh boy, you're about to get your phone back, aren't you? Let's go collect our bags and away from this mosquito-infested backwoods dump. Doors locked, bags inside. <sighs> Fuck me. Yep. Well, it's obvious what we have to do here. Find someone with a key? Shape our destiny. And by shape our destiny, I mean shape our way through this crappy lock and grab our bags. Okay. Let's do it. We better not get into trouble. I won't tell if you won't tell. Mr. Hackett's gonna find out. So what? He'll just think it was a bear or something. Have you ever seen a bear in these woods? No, but that doesn't mean they're not out there. Fair point. All right, let's do this. On three. One, 
two, three. Ugh. All about the power of positive thinking. Why do I ever listen to you? Because I'm always right. Are you sure they're gonna think it was a bear? Oh my God, relax. It's not like we killed someone. All right, well, I'm just gonna take another look around, make sure we didn't miss anything. Go nuts. Aw, this was little Izzy's. get you back to Izzy. It's gonna be weird not waking up to Dylan's morning announcements. Why would this place be in the news? I can't believe I'm actually gonna miss all those lumpy loose springs. is not going to be happy that the kids just left this year. I'll tell Chris about it when we see him. Jacob hasn't seen this. <sighs> Ugh. Ugh, what 
is that? Is it Dylan's? Ugh. Ready to roll? Let's do it. Finally. Time to let loose and vamoose this caboose. How are you so dramatic? Annoying. Confident. It's just acting. It's what the people want. So you're faking it? I mean, in a way, faking it is just being yourself, but louder. You should try it sometime. You never know who you might impress. No, <laughs> It's too late now anyway. For what? You and Nick? You never know unless you put yourself out there. In text. Jinkies. Okay, so hypothetically, if I were to put myself out there, what if he ends up being a dud, kind of like you and Jacob? He's actually really sweet. Then why'd you quit it? Summer fling. We're going to school like four states away. I, he gets it. Yeah, sure. But that's us. You and Nick could be different. Why don't you get his handle? Hit him up. Oh, I already have his email. It was in the packet they gave to us on the first day. Email? Are you 93? What's wrong with email? I'm really gonna miss you, Abby. Oh, hold up! Oh, but the lodge is that way. Go right here. Why? Come on, scenic route? One last victory lap around the camp? Sure. What's the victory? Two months. No technology. I kind of thought it was nice to be offline. Ugh, I didn't. Plus, my subs need me. You know what? I actually believe you. Abby, was that a compliment? Your charm is infectious. What can I say? <laughs> I'd subscribe. You better. As soon as you get home, sub, share, smash that like button. The holy trinity. Okay, well now I'm really regretting it. Oh no, you love me. <laughs> My favorite spot? The fire pit? The island. Mad secluded, right? Is, is that smoke? Should we tell someone? Mm, it looks pretty contained. It's probably just Mr. H burning some stuff before, you know, he closes camp for the summer. Yeah. Speaking of which, we should we should probably, you know, get back. Oh yeah. Worried Nick's, you know, gonna leave without you. Well, no, they're probably like all waiting for us. Mm-hmm. Everyone's waiting for us. Everyone, yeah. Nick. Waiting for you. All everyone. Same. Don't worry, Jacob, I got you. I got a full tank of gas, so... Oh, fuck me. 
<laughs> oh, idiot. <laughs> Does nobody own phone chargers anymore? It, there's no signal out here anyways, dude, okay? This place is like patchy as balls. <sighs> Your balls are patchy? What? No. It's okay, I'll just go get some juice from Mr. H before we go. And... Uh, you. <sighs> Hey, Nick. Hey, where were you guys? <gasps> Wouldn't you like to know? Ignore her, please. Let's go. Just gotta get these bags up on to the... Oh, hey, hey, here. Let me, um, let me get it for you. I can take uh, care of my own bag, thank you. Are you sure? Because, I mean, it's really not that big she of a deal. She can take care of her own bag, thank you. We can both take care of our own bag, thank you. Cool. Uh, uh, Abby, do you need? Yeah. Can I 